Well, you know, there are dozens of martial art forms in the world, so if you'd like to learn a discipline to protect yourself, you'll likely find one that would fit your needs. Yeah, last week we showed you how to use a gun right away, but if you can't get to your weapon, that's when you have to start to think about some other option. And Kara Dixon has been mm -hmm. investigating, speaking with several people, and she's here now to tell us how some Beaumont residents are choosing to protect themselves. Kara, what did you find? Shelter, for one Beaumont martial arts instructor, his saying is, you don't always have a gun to protect yourself. At the Texas Punishment Crew Studio in Beaumont, Jason Ebarb is not only teaching students what to do to protect themselves, he's also changing lives. Watching the Ultimate Fighting Championship on TV changed Adam Chance's life. I heard the guys talking about jujitsu, and they said that's where it's at. They said fights end up on the ground. So Chance decided to take his own chance on the martial art and took a class. It blew my mind. There were kids that, that smaller than me that would manhandle me, and I, I just I couldn't understand, so I figured that I had to keep coming back to get better. Five years later, he's still here, working to get better at the Texas Punishment Crew Studio in Beaumont. There's nothing wrong with carrying a weapon or anything like that, but you may not be able to be uh, able to access it. Jason Ebarb is a jiu-jitsu instructor. Like Chance, he saw UFC and MMA fighting on TV 17 years ago and fell in love. The sport is popular with men, women, and children. Brazilian jiu-jitsu is a self-defense martial arts. It's all based on leverage and technique, so therefore the, the size and the strength a lot of time doesn't play a major, major factor. Ebarb says jiu-jitsu is a grappling sport, different than other hand-to-hand -hand combat because it's more like wrestling. We're closing the distance and we're getting it to the ground and the ultimate goal is to win by a submission. Ebarb says his students join for all different reasons, from getting in shape to learning self-defense. But he says jujitsu is more than just a martial art. It's a lifestyle. Benefits that you get from that as far as the physical uh, fitness aspect and the confidence and character benefits that you gain from it as well. Is you just fall in love with it because uh, you know that anywhere you go that you're safe, you, you feel safe, you feel confident. And protected no matter what. Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is a weapon that you carry everywhere with you. Ebarb says the studio was started in 1993, around the time Jiu Jitsu became popular in the U.S., and he teaches 14 classes a week. Next week, I'll be taking a look at non lethal personal defense devices.